Hey everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to fix a common error that pops up when trying to transfer photos and videos directly from an iPhone to a PC. I've seen a lot of people having this problem and even some videos explaining how to fix the error, but a lot of these tutorials take forever to get to the solution so I'd like to help you guys solve this problem as quickly as possible. So first, I'll show you what the error looks like. Um, so basically, you first connect your iPhone to your PC using a USB cable, and then you'll see a pop-up on your phone that asks if you want to trust the PC device. So just tap on Allow, and then you'll be able to see your photos and your videos on your computer. So now, if you go to the File Explorer on Windows, and go to Apple iPhone, and then open the DCIM folder, you'll see two more folders. And the one on the right is your iCloud photos and videos, and you shouldn't have any problems transferring these, but on the left, you'll see this folder which contains your local photos and videos that are stored directly on your phone. And if we open up this folder and try to transfer these over to your PC, you'll then see the error. And it simply says, error copying file or folder, the device is unreachable. So to fix this, just go to your iPhone settings, go to photos, and at the very bottom, you'll see a setting called transfer to Mac or PC. Now automatic will be the selection by default, but you'll want to change this to keep originals. And this is basically the fix, pretty simple. So after you change the setting, um, unplug your phone from your PC and plug it in again. And then you have to trust your PC again. And then on your PC, navigate to the file directory. And at this point, if we try to do the transfer, it should work. So as you can see, when we try to copy the video over to our PC, it does successfully copy over, and you can do the same for a photo, and you can open uh, the photo, and there you go. So at this point, most of you should be good to go, but there is one more thing I'd like to mention, and that is, for some of you, you may not be able to open this file on Windows, uh, a video file that you transferred. And essentially, it'll say that you need a new codec and you have to buy this uh, video extension player. So um, there's a few other workarounds. And essentially, you have this HEVC codec now. And that's just something that occurs when you're doing the transfer from iPhone to PC. And there's not really anything you can do about it. But I mean, once you have the file, there are a few things you can do. So um, if you're just trying to view these files and back up your media, one thing you can do is get the VLC media player and that will actually allow you to play these videos. So if you just open with VLC, as you can see, the video is playing. Um, and then also if you're trying to edit the media, then there should be no problem. Most uh, video editors these days do accept this file format with no problems, and you can just drag and drop. Yeah, so I just wanna let you know that this is something that might happen. I don't wanna to get too deep into different solutions on this video, but if you'd like me to make another one on how to uh, convert the file format, how to work with it, then just let me know and I can make one of those videos for you guys as well. So that's about it for this one. Hopefully I was able to fix your problem and if you have any questions, please leave a comment down below and I will try to get to you as quickly as possible.